Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, let's figure out how to find the cube root of 6859, 6859, and the cube root of 8000 using a factor tree. You can find these without a calculator and uh, may come in handy sometimes. So first what we have is we have, uh, let's begin a factor tree. We have 19 times 361, circle the 19 because it is prime. And then 19 times 19 is 361. I can place them now back under the cube root sign. And if you have groups of three, you may pull out a group of three. And in this case, we have no more numbers underneath. So the cube root of 6,859 is indeed 19. Now let's take a look at 8,000 and... Let's do the same thing if I can get this placed under here properly. Okay, let's get started. Okay, 8,000 ends in zero, so I'm going to begin with twos. So you have two times 4,000. Circle the two because it's prime. Now two times 2,000. Circle the two. Two times 1,000. Circle the two. Now we're down to two times 500. Now we're, let's try 2 times 250, and now 2 times 125. Now we no longer have an even number, so we've got to switch gears a little bit. And 5 times 125, excuse me, not 5 times 125, 5 times 25, excuse me, equals 125. And then we're down to 5 times 5. So... Pretty big factor tree, and so now what we do is we're going to do the exact same thing. We're going to place all these prime numbers under the cube root sign. So we have a 2, 2, 2, another group, 2, 2, 2, and then three fives. We do the exact same thing, pull out groups of 3 because it's a cube root, and then just multiply these together. So we have 2 times 2 is 4 times 5 equals 20. So the cube root of 8,000 equals 20. Thanks for watching and remember kindness multiplies kindness. Be kind to someone today.